interrupting this content to introduce myself because we may have some new friends here. My name is Kili Namikis. I am 26 years old. I am a professional dancer and performer based in New York City, but I'm currently on tour around the country with a children's show, and I'm currently in Santa Monica, California. So thanks for tuning in. I'm so happy you're here and enjoy the rest of the video. Okay, today is slightly different from normal post-show because I had to try out all of my Disney outfits. So I knew after I showered, I wasn't going to want to change in and out of clothes a bunch of times. But the first thing I do usually when I get home is jump in the shower and get unsweaty. So I'm going to jump in the shower and wash my hair and do all that fun stuff. And I'll check back in with you in a few. I'm done and out of the shower and clearly did not dry my hair enough. The next step in my routine for the night is to put leave-in conditioner in and brush it through my hair. Also will, once my shower is a little drier, insert clip here. I lied. I was gonna pop in and show you the products that I have in my shower that I obviously have had with me and have been using this entire tour. However, my shower is still wet and I just don't want to grab everything because it's all like soaking wet from being on the floor of my shower. So I'm gonna put some photos right here. <laughs> For shampoo and conditioner, I use the Way shampoo and conditioner. I use the medium hair. I love it, I've been using it for a couple years now and it has worked really well for me and kept my hair really healthy. I also will sometimes, and by sometimes I mean once a week, wash my hair with head and shoulders shampoo. I have a really dry scalp and sometimes it gets flaky. Usually once a week washing with that tends to keep that way under control. I try to use a tree hot sugar scrub, especially on days that I shave my legs just to exfoliate and keep my skin bright. And then I usually use like a body wash I alternate around, I'm not tied to one, but currently on tour just for the ease of travel, I've been traveling with the bar soap, which is new for me for the last six months, but I, as if you can see, it's actually right up there. I use the Dr. Bronner's bar soap in, I think the tea tree oil scent. I'll put a picture right here. <laughs> and that's what's in my shower. Right, I'm gonna put in some leave-in conditioner. I currently am using the Way by Rado collab love this i spray about six sprays in my hair and i brush it out with a wet brush cut to b-roll okay next i put on some lotion because i shave my legs the lotion i'm currently using i just got when i got here it's method body it's the pure peace scent i didn't know they had lotion of this i used to use the body wash of this back in new york but i currently just have a bar soap with me on the road so I'm gonna put this on my legs because I shave my legs and also my arms because my upper arm gets really, really dry for some reason. I didn't use this today, but usually when I shower, especially if I just do a body shower because then my hair's up, I will spray some of this Pacifica Acne Warrior spray on my upper back, like the backs of my shoulders. We wear a tight long sleeve underneath our costumes and in every show we do our 20 minute dance set, we have a 15 minute break, we get a little cool, the sweat dries a little bit and then we go back after meet and greet. So obviously sweat, dry sweat in the same clothes. It makes the skin, especially on my, like the backs of my shoulders, prone to some breakouts, especially like the back of my shoulders and my chest. And I change my shirt between every single show to prevent it, but I spray this sometimes if things are popping up and I like it. Next, obviously I wash my face. The face wash that I use currently is the it's the People Kale and Green Tea Spinach Vitamins Face Wash. I've been using this for a couple years now. It is so gentle, I really love it. I have sensitive skin, so it just is gentle, it cleans my face and nothing is irritated. And it's super clean, which I love. I bought this when I started this tour. I use a Ferreo, and this is the travel size skin like face cleaner. It's silicone, it has these little bristles. Vibrations really get any dirt like off of my skin any sweat, etc. from the day. I really loved it and it has kept my skin looking really healthy. I've gone a couple of facials while I was on tour and every time they commented how good my skin looks for how much I'm sweating inside a mascot head. So definitely would recommend. I got this on sale at Sephora. I think it was maybe $80 when I got it on sale or it's $80 and it was on sale for less. Don't remember, but definitely worth the investment. It's fully waterproof, so you can keep it in the shower. Depending on where I am, if there are shelves in the shower or not, my housing, I will keep in the shower or my counter in my bathroom. Um, it's fully waterproof and I haven't had to charge it yet and it's been like five months, so would recommend for sure. My toxic trait is that I wash my face with cold water. 
Actually, I don't know if that's a normal thing, but um, I feel like maybe people like to wash their face with warm water and I don't, so. Now that that is done, I'm gonna do my next step in my skincare routine, which is exfoliating. It is the end of a show week, so I'm gonna use an exfoliator. I don't exfoliate all the time. I alternate um, about every other day. I use the Anadelic Acid Superfood Unity Exfoliant from You Two People, and I love it. But today, it's the end of the show week. I'm gonna use an M61 Perfect Peel. Super easy, it's one step. You literally just wipe it over your face and neck and you then moisturize. I think I even have another day that I'm doing my skincare routine on tour. So uh, you're gonna get this these clips twice, but you'll get my morning routine with that video. So you're welcome. All right, we'll resume skincare shortly. We're gonna let this soak in. Will I continue to wait for the exfoliant to dry on my face? Please enjoy these clips of me clearing off my bed and sorting out all my clean laundry that I've had in my closet all week. <laughs> done i'm going to finish my skincare and then eat because i'm so hungry i'm doing on my skincare routine the next thing i use in the evenings is this ordinary serum it is the multi-peptide hyaluronic acid serum I take about three drops of that in my hand and i just rub it all over my face the next thing i use after that is this skinceuticals hydrating b5 gel i usually take about two drops of this because a little goes a long way put on my fingers and all over my face. In the evenings, I use two separate moisturizers. I use an eye cream and a normal moisturizer. I use this Beauty of the People Super, Ber Super Berry Hydrating Glittery Mask, and I just dip my finger in it four times on each quadrant of my face. <laughs> this jar is pretty big, and I've had it for a long time. It really lasts a long way. You don't need that much and it really does you get your money's worth i think for these products and they're clean which to me is really important with a lot of the beauty products and skincare that i use then i go in with my youth of the people eye cream under my eyes around the corners on my eyelid it's called the dream eye cream lastly my rescue rose water spray on my face vaseline on my lips this is the cocoa butter one. And that's my skincare. I'm gonna throw a sweatshirt on because I am cold and make dinner. Okay, step one of dinner, Diet Coke. Diet Coke dinner. Okay, I finished eating dinner. I had Trader Joe's Thai green curry. It was vegan. I'm not vegan, but it was vegan. It was very spicy. I don't love spicy food. I was hoping it was gonna be a little more mild than it was. We survived. And I also had a cookie and a Trader Joe's Hold the Cone, the peppermint version. So good. It's now time for me to put these clothes away and climb into bed. Usually the last thing I do before I go to bed is scroll TikTok for a while and I read every single night. I love reading. I try to read about 10% of a book a day on my Kindle. I'm currently reading Fourth Wing by Rebecca Yaros and I'm loving it. It is so good. Probably gonna accidentally stay up way too late reading that. But yeah, thank you for following along. Uh, another day of Vlogmas and I will see you tomorrow. Good night.